Hey, what's right. going on, Killzone fans? Vicious underscore doing live commentary. Uh -huh. So we're going to get right into this. Those plants I'm shooting right now, they're called scorpion plants, and they will take your life points away. If you stand there, they will continue to hack away at you until you die. This plant, though, watch what happens when you shoot it. They hurt. And that Which plant is, is called a stinger plant. And when it explodes, it'll Damn send out sharp spiders. spines flying in all directions. So it can come in handy. Also, um, this guy up ahead, his name is Kozlowski. He's a veteran ISA soldier who specializes in the tracking. So he's going to be our uh, guide through this part of the chapter. So pay attention to what he has to say. He has a lot to offer. And there they are. Those are held in spiders, and you really need to watch up for those because if you're too close, even when you shoot them, they have acid. Kind of like the acid for blood if, if anyone has seen uh, the Aliens trilogy. When the aliens blow up, the acid yeah, can still get on your that. body Thanks. and get take away damage from you. So be careful of those too. Shoot them from a little bit safe from a safe distance. And so our, uh, our objective right now in this jungle valley we need to establish the comms uplink at the cruiser wreckage, and that's going to take us a while to get up to. You know, those crickets in the background. Cutscene right here. Look. Those are capture troopers, we know what happened to the recon team. and this is the first time we have seen them in this I don't think they can see us here in the part dark. of the game. I'll take the guy on the left. You'll get the guy on the right. Sarge, knife him. Shake and bake. Nice work. There's, There's a guy up in the ledge. Shoot him in the head. Cause Lousy's so just like shoot him in the head. Warn the captain. If anybody has played Metal Gear, Sons of Liberty, instead, sir. you know, or the uh, Twin Snakes, um, Metal Gear, this section's kind of, this whole, like, part of the chapter is kind of like that. It's very stealthy, so that's why they gave you the this gun. I believe it's the M66. So, this is more of a stealth, Wait, at least close. a pure stealth run. You can cap him right in the head. Wait for him to turn around, and you can He's give him a yours. quick melee kill. Shake and bake. Let's go. Also, in on this level right here, um, there are two trophies you can get. One is called Just Never There the Trophy, and sense. the other one is Turn the Tables on, Trophy. On. Come on, let's move back. There is a plant that you can shoot that can take out both these guys. We can't get through with them around. Remember what I told you about standing too close to a burster? Whatever you do, do it fast. Guy walked right by me. Shake and bake. Shake and bake. Nice. Follow me. Captain Nardo and Kowalski. Sir, the Hellgast are here. Okay, to the earn the never there before trophy, um, if you happen to I'm alert done. one of the guards during this chapter, all you have to do is um, restart from the last checkpoint to try to clear the area undetected again. So, it can be pretty useful. Because it will allow you to also attempt to unlock the Turn the Tables trophy by getting detected and then killing one of the capture troopers with a melee attack with when it closes Listen, in. So that's how you carriers. get the, the Turn the Tables trophy. All you have to do is kill um, Sarge, one of the I'm capture a troopers with a melee this. kill. But after that, all you have to be do is go a pure stealth run and you can earn the Never We've There no trophy. Chance if these carriers see us. Better stick to the shadows. 
troopers. Vita, out. Things like growling like a dog. It is made of metal, and I growl. You take this one. If so, if you want to earn the never there before, before trophy, you gotta take your time on this. Be patient. Shake and bake. You hear him anywhere but the head, he's gonna call for help. It's also a good idea, you'll see a lot of little mini caves. Perfect good to sneak up and do this. Shake and bake. If you know this map well, use it use it to its full potential and you can take out the hell gas simply one by one. Two more higgs. I believe this is where you can use that plant to hey, explode them. Walking past. Yeah. That plant. That's it, um, Koslowski's trying to l remind you of what he showed you previous, earlier on in the game. It took me a while to get this trophy, I'll admit. It, it takes some patience. You gotta really know their pattern, so it might take a few runs, but... If you guys are really, like, anal about getting uh, the trophies like I was, uh... Some, yeah, there's some points where you really just gotta take your time in this, so. Oh boy. I'm gonna get caught here. What's that? Squad, <laughs> Whatever. Oh, this just got clipped in the head. This is only a bad part. Um, nobody revives you, so you gotta keep that in mind, too. So, anyway, you can. You all get the gist of, of of what's going on here. Oh, I got you in my sights. <laughs> I take out the guy in the first the first one. He tries to like call for help, and I'm like, nah. Alright, looks like we got a decent firefight here. Um, the capture troopers are be, are going to be coming, so that's what you need to switch to your stop 52. Your M66 won't take out those uh, capture troopers, so keep that in mind as well. This is straight up guerrilla warfare right now. With that dramatic music going on in the background. Dun dun dun! Guy was hiding behind that behind the brush right there. Real quick, if you guys, when it's really quiet, you guys can hear all different things on this level, and that's why I really this is probably one of my favorite levels in the campaign because you hear like crickets, you hear like the spiders. It's just it's pretty amazing. You hear the like birds, you hear the insects, so. It really makes you feel like you're in the jungle. It's pretty sick. You got all these different colors here. I don't even know what the heck they are. Probably some tropical fungus. Damn spiders. See, can you hear all the background noise? It's pretty awesome. Kaslowski, I'm telling you, you look like one of the Hell's Angel. Like you have a chopper for a motorcycle. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Captain Normal, this is Sevchenko. Come in. Speak to me, soldier. Do you have a visual on the uplink? Yeah, I see it all right. Sir, there's a massive military buildup here. They're obviously not here for a down cruiser. You need to evacuate the camp immediately. Sergeant, please don't make me repeat myself. It's beyond goddamn necessary that I have that uplink. Yes, sir. Can do. Of 
Kowalski. I'll deal with the uplink. You get back to base. Convince Narval to get everybody out of there. Yes, sir. Like I said, you're going to hear all sorts of no no uh, sounds in this part of the game. I mean, I think those are more like some type of water bird or something. Maybe a Helgen bird. Understood, sir. I'm on my way now. The troop carriers have arrived. Wait here. I'll be right back. Yes, sir. You easily sneak up on this guy, pull a melee kill. Shake and bake. More like the slice and dice. Wish I had a tent. Pull out the banjo. Hot dog and beans. Relax. Sing songs and think about the purdy jammer. Oh, here we go. Malik Hill. Shake and bake. This is a really good stealth run here, everybody. Watch what I do. I'll wait for this guy to walk around. Wait for him to come come back. Malik kill him. There's a guy to the far left over there. There's another guy up above. And in the far back, there's, I believe there's another guy. Yeah, there's another guy in the very far back on the second level, too. So. It's got to be a little patient right here. Here he comes. What is that goo under my feet? Oh, that sounds so gross. Get him. Shake and bake. Okay, now I'm going to go through this little cave part. You can shoot this guy in the head. There you go. Another another one down. And there he is. And right there, nice shot. And there's another guy uh, r right above me. And there's also another guy... If you look straight down through that um, opening, there's another guy standing right there. So that's the last guy that you want to get. This guy can be a little bit tricky, so be very patient here. And you need to watch out for... Oh, crap. <laughs> crap. Oh, my God. I can't believe I just did that. That was bad. I just committed suicide. Slice and dice. Oh my god. Uh, hey, fine. I know you guys are all laughing at me. That's fine. I deserve it. Alright, let's get back to this. <laughs> Shoot him in the head. God, they just dropped like a bad habit. You can hear like the thud. Shoot this guy in the What's face. That? Oh, crap. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Nothing now. <laughs> What's that? Dush! Alright, this is the last guy. There he is. You can run up and melee kill him. Slice and dice. That's all of them. Pretty stealthy, huh? Besides my suicide... Uh, there, where's my corpse? That's down below. Thank God I got my nine lives. Meow, meow, meow. Oh shit, wait, is that another one? No, okay, I thought that was one other one, just standing there being retarded. I think that stuff right here, like all the vine, I think that's from the, from the spiders. Pretty nasty, huh? I heard that the Helgen spiders, like, they'll eat your, eat your body, like, they'll all swarm up and eventually devour you, right down to the bone, to the core. All right, so moving on here. You also... 
you also can be very stealthy here and actually go through this whole part without getting caught. I do get caught up here, just to let you all know. So, but if you really want to get that um, never there trophy, at this point right here, you need to be very quiet and take your time. Oh, there's one. This is very tricky. There's another guy up above. Alright, so I'm going to stop this right now. And uh, we're going to do the next segment. Because I'm running out of time here. Alright, see you guys in the next uh, video. Take it easy. Thank you for watching.